Confidence. Oh, I see how it is. Getting your throw bag in the tree is all about. Oh. Oh yeah. You see this focus? It's so it's focused and filled. So focused. I don't know if it's translating. <laughs> Boom! So this is where we are. I'm here with uh, Drew from Drew's Odd Brain. So is. Yeah, it so is. Yeah. We're gonna go tree camping down there. Of course, recently, all of the tree camping tr adventures that I've been planning have always ended with high winds or extreme colds. Today, it's a little bit of both. The wind isn't too bad, but uh, it's definitely cold. It was in the negatives this morning. It's, it's brisk. It's brisk. It's brisk. <laughs> Very sharp, cold. I think one thing that I don't really talk about very much in my videos is the actual hike. Because all my videos are focused on, on just the tree climb. But uh, one of my favorite parts about doing this is coming out here and looking for the tree. Like that's one of the best parts. This, this looks yeah. like some kind of marsh. <laughs> We're... We're currently trying to figure out what we're hiking on because just like two days ago, it was so warm that none of the rivers were frozen. And then suddenly, we are. We're, kind of river all right, we're on a marshy river. It's been confirmed. Okay. And uh, now if I'm afraid that if we start walking on some ice, it's going to be super thin because although it's really cold right now, it hasn't been cold for very long. So, you know, I don't, I personally don't want to go swimming on this trip. I don't know about you. I've been following the Wim Hof method, man. <laughs> Wim Hof, he teaches you that, you know, cold doesn't matter. Just get in your underwear, go swim in some cold water, and you're good. Man, <laughs> I, I'm down for it. Let's just, let's just get naked and go. The, the nature. The river's over there. <laughs> That's what it's all about, my friend. So, I think we found some biggins. We've been just kind of hiking around in here. And uh, I see some very large trees. Let's go take a look. What do you think of this tree, huh? That's a long tree. Yeah. Wait, go stand, go stand by it. You gotta give people perspective. Perspective! <laughs> oh, it's a honker, all right. Look at that. Dude, all right, look at those two, too. Ah. Uh. Yeah, good boy. We definitely found our spot. I was just telling Drew that uh, the way I choose my tree is by looking at each one and deciding which one looks easier to climb. That's how I choose my tree. All right, there's a stick in my way. No, no. Ah! <laughs> Failed. Yeah, man, just knock it down. I'm gonna stand back here though. It's the best of trees, dude. Graceful. Use this giant puzzle. Remove this branch. Oh, I don't know, man. <laughs> yeah. I, don't, I don't know that this is necessarily working. You know, I actually don't need it gone. I just wanted to watch you do this. Uh -huh. Yeah! <laughs> Oh. oh, yeah. You see this focus? It's so focused and filled. So focused. I don't know if it's translating. <laughs> ah, dang it! Straight up again! <laughs> so, um. I'm just showing them what not to do. You're aiming for this tree, <laughs> but you keep hitting this tree. <laughs> my hands are cold. Can that be my, uh,. Oh yeah, that's real. My excuse. That's that's really real. All right, you better get this after all that heckling. <laughs> ah, did we have? Oh man, no! Wow. Dang it, that looked like it was going for it too. Son of a! I'm so small. <laughs> So we celebrated extravagantly when uh, Drew hit the crotch with the throw line. It went up, 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 and it was just silence. And then bam, high five and all around. It was a perfect, flawless uh, throw line shot. So I uh, already got the line set up. 
I'm up in the tree. The sun's getting close to going down, so we're gonna try to make it before, uh, I wanna get the portal edges up before it gets totally dark. Drew is literally running circles around trees right now to stay warm. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, Drew. All right, I'm gonna get this throw. You guys ready? Into that crotch. Here goes. Oh, God! <laughs> Oh man, I caught my camera on the USB cable from my microphone. All right, I'm done recording until we get the portal ledges set up. Back on the ground, got the ledges up, got my beautiful pillow. Did you bring a pillow? <sighs> I can't sleep without my pillow. Mm. Now comes the hard part. Actually, that was the hard part. This is the semi less hard part. Gonna bring the ledges up in the tree, build camp, eat some food, and uh, and then maybe shiver the whole night in our sleeping bags. I'm not gonna be a pessimist. I'm gonna be an optimist from now on. We're gonna sleep nice and warm. All right. Oh, the sun is definitely down now, and uh, we're making our way up in the tree. We have a lot of gear to bring up, so I'm not looking forward to that we got a uh, pulley system rigged up and we just double teamed both portal edges and uh and both backpacks full of gear right now yeah. come on reach yeah. higher reach. i'm just i just have him uh clip it in his his portal edge i'm getting a butt cramp <laughs> a butt cramp hold on oh my god oh my tush i'm so sorry that i'm laughing <laughs> Hey, pull that down. Pull it. There you go. Ah! Yes! Ah! Nailed it! Woo! Brilliant. <laughs> we got the portal edges set up. Yeah. Hey! Here's a tree camping pro tip from the canopy. Uh -huh. Building an anchor on your pillow so that you don't drop it in the middle of the night like that. Oh! Oh! oh. You lost your pillow! Oh! Well, sir, you would be wrong. I didn't lose it. It's still right here. Pro tip. <laughs> if you don't sleep with a pillow, you can't drop it. <laughs> camping with people is so much more fun than camping alone. You can say that of a lot of things. That's true. Drew's already in bed. Said he's going to look at the stars for a little bit and head to sleep. I'm going to finish crawling into my sleeping bag. We decided not to put the rain flies up even though we brought them because uh, it's kind of windy out. And we didn't want them to be flapping in the wind, keeping us awake all night. But yeah, I'm going to uh, shut everything down, stare at the stars for a while and go to sleep. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, guys. It's 6.30 a.m. and it's still dark outside. I mean, huddled inside by Bivy. I don't really want to go out and get cold, so I'm just gonna look at the stars until uh, Drew wakes up and then we'll probably hang out, have some breakfast. Drew! Buenos dias! <laughs> Wait, that's, isn't that good day? Who cares? Say good morning Hi, and... Hi, can be us. It, was that good morning? No, let's go with God. <laughs> Good morning! There we go. All right, the sun is not yet up. And wait, oh, the moon just disappeared. I swear it was just up in the canopy. As you can see, I'm eating some delicious frozen Pop-Tarts. It's gonna take a lot to get me out of my sleeping bag this morning because uh, I have some awesome views and it's really freaking cold out, so. I'm just gonna, I might just stay here all day. I'll just stay here until I die. I think, oh, actually, the sun hasn't fully crested yet. And we're just, we're hanging here, like we said we were going to. Hey, how about you give another wave to the camera for us all? <laughs> there it is. All right, I finally got out of my sleeping bay. Uh, Drew is gonna wrap down to the ground using the Gree Gree for the first time. Maybe. <laughs> as long as you don't pull it and panic and pull it back and fall to your death, you'll be okay. Just don't fall. Don't, you just say as long as I don't die, I'll be okay? As long as you don't die, you'll be okay. I'm no longer nice and warm in my sleeping bag. Now I'm stuck hugging an ice cold frozen tree. It's, uh, it's really awesome up here. The sun's finally up. 
You can see the frozen river, all the shimmering in the snow and watching the little critters scamper by. It's a fantastic morning. I'm just happy that it's not really windy. Yesterday we were in a big rush to head out because we wanted to do a bunch of climbing before the sun went down. And I'm like, you know what? I better check my checklist just in case we forgot something. Almost forgot the toilet paper. All right, poop duty. Here it comes. As I say, if it gets stuck in the crash, that'd be really disappointing. <laughs> it didn't get stuck though, huh? No. Yes, I know. I was climbing around and now I'm back to sitting on my portal edge. But it's snack time again. This is the first time I tried these. Bada bean, bada boom. They're flava beans with sweet sriracha flavor and I can wholeheartedly endorse them because they are super delicious. All right, it's time to take down the portal edges. I was looking at Drew's setup. He has a uh, MSR bivy and a 20 degree down sleeping bag and that's all he had. So uh, I'm pretty happy that it made it through the night in relative warmth. He said he was off and on cold, but uh, I'm gonna take these down, get out of the tree and we're just gonna hike around and go for a little mini adventure today. Bombs away. Okay, everything's taken out. I'm gonna rappel out of the tree, one-handed while wearing a mitten and recording myself. Let's see if I can not die. I say this every time, and every time I almost kill myself. <laughs> Woo! Just gets a little speedy. And it is. And it is what it is. All right. Okay, well, feels good to be back down on the ground after being in the tree for so long. It's a lot easier to stay warm down on the ground than it is up in the tree exposed to the wind. We have all of our gear spread out, pack up, and uh, then we're gonna, hey. Hey, Drew. <laughs> yes, thank you, Drew, for coming with. It was a fantastic adventure. It was. It was. I, I, again, I said this a lot already, but it's so much more fun to go tree climbing with friends. So thank you for coming. Thank you. <laughs> that was, I'm glad we could share that moment together. <laughs> All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this adventure. Ah, my lips are too cold. Mwah, mwah. Let's try this again. Mwah, mwah. Mwah, mwah. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this adventure. Goodbye and be safe.